Drinking is not my hobby. It's my lover's last game. I see the water, ice covered in ink and bleach Cross out the ones who heard my cries and watch me weep Hey guys, good morning and welcome back to the channel Fire spreading all around the world It's so bright, it's hard to breathe, but that's alright Hush Nanda has a vacation of a new Nolita Diri KP travel. Okay, so today we are going to Ranganati to birds in the district of Mandia, like 130 from Bangalore. So and it now it's 7:32, and yes, exactly, it has crocodiles. So let's go. So we are going to the Nitwik. Today we are going to see birds in crocodiles. Today we are going to see birds in crocodiles. Yes, so there are so many crocodiles. So, Rangana Tito Bird Sensory is also known as Pakshi Kashi of Karnataka. It is a bird sensory in the Mandya district of the state of Karnataka in India. With 40 acres of land and more than 170 species of bird, it is one of the biggest bird sensory in Karnataka. Ranganati to bird sensory is located at a distance of 19 km from Mysore city and about 128 km away from the city of Bangalore. Lying beautifully on the banks of River Kaveri, this sanctuary is the home to some of the most exquisite birds. We are away, we are 128 kilometers away from Ranganathitu. Everyone is here. So this is new guy. The <laughs> weather is very nice today. So this is the best part of the trip. Now we are going to have breakfast. So, which I always look forward to when I come outside of the city because you know I always tell you the outside food if you come to Mysore this side this is really good uh, especially the breakfast this is called Udupi Baba Vaivaha so here we will be having our breakfast so, waiting for them to come Anete what do you want to have? Puri and ice cream Puri and ice cream you will have both Puri and ice cream huh? So, I can get juice also here. Yeah. So there is juice, noodles, everything is available. So, if you have not had a breakfast at your home, so you can come and definitely have here. And the only concern is too much people. So, Corona time definitely they should maintain something, but uh, I don't see any. Uh, so don't know. Let's see. So our puri You want to have this one? Okay. The breakfast. Onion tapam. I am having one idli, then I will have this puri. Idli is again really good, and as I said, this is the best part coming out and having the breakfast outside because those breakfasts are really nice. You will not get in the city, definitely. And we will have some tea and coffee as well. So, our tea and coffee also came. Alright, so let's have breakfast and we will head out because it's uh, another, I think, one and a half hour is there for us to reach. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to like, share and subscribe and definitely keep on watching. Named after the Hindu god Sri Ranganathaswami, 
This bird sanctuary is spread across an area of 40 acres. In the 1600, a small dam across the Kaveri River led to the formation of Ranganatetu sanctuary. So if you guys coming to Mysore on the site like Ranganatetu for visiting, definitely come very early because the roads are still getting constructed this side you can see. Very much congested, uh, like too much traffic. Uh, morning like 7.30 we have left from there and still 57 minutes left to reach. So make sure you come early, leave early from Bangalore. Plus after three and a half hour journey we have reached. Now one minute more, so that is the gate. Rich. Okay, so how are you feeling it week? I'm feeling good. And take slip nicely. Plus a... So 60 rupees entry. I think if you get a camera, it will be more chargeable. And friends, way to boating point. Hey, So here we got the tickets, this costed like 700 which include uh, boating as well as for 4 members You can see the Salim Ali Information Center and here is the ticket counter So here it is the ticket counter and all like the price chart You do have this option as well if you like don't want to walk and I think for this one it will be extra charge Because for camera it is extra charges, that's why they are checking also. I didn't see. This is awesome. See the tree man. Oh shit. This looks awesome. So this is way to Maharaja Tower. So this is a viewpoint. Spotting this side. <laughs> so you forgot it. Every time is the time where uh, like you will have more outside birth here because of the weather. So we will go for the boating. We have already taken the tickets. Small for me, but I have to adjust. Yeah. 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 So Yeah. 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 So if luck favors, you'll see a crocodile as well. It was because of world's renowned ornithologist Dr. Salim Sali's determination and ability to convince the then Mysore Maharaja that Ranganatha Tetu was declared as a protected area. 
he while surveying the area noticed a wide variety of birds here and hence highlighted the importance of declaring this area as a bird sanctuary compromising six small island this place was declared as a bird sanctuary in the year of 1940 and crocodiles and yes crocodiles and we are in the middle of crocodiles and birds so definitely zodia hai it explains for why he was you can definitely click some instagram worthy pictures here actually this is what is the main attraction the boating uh, i think it took us around half an hour to finish it from here you can see from there will take you from here that side one round here actually initially ye log पहले और राइड ऑफर करते थे उधर अंदर लेके जाते थे पर आई डोंट थिंक सो दे डू इट एनी मोर मे बी द वाटर इज मोर दैट्स यो देर इज सो मेनी फीस इज फियर आई डोंट नो इफ यू कैन सी हो सो मेनी फीस इज ओके सो दिस इज दिस लुक्स नाइस फॉर फोटो आल्सो अच्छा I'll take one click here and you guys can check out my Instagram here I'll post those pics So definitely come here if you are in Bangalore this is a very huge area actually uh they have those shuttles that can carry you and if you have, like have elderly people or jo log hai matlab zyada chal nahi payenge for that it will be very useful because it's a huge area if you are a bird watcher and bird lover definitely you should come here and if you have those big lenses those costly lenses then you can take definitely some awesome pics so those are the towers like watch towers from there you can view and take nice pics down there this is so peaceful there is like only bird sound if you like listen <laughs> like share and don't forget to subscribe subscribe button will be here all right If you want to come from Bangalore, one seventy kilometer, I think one not seventy, I think one forty kilometer. Friends and family. So yes, so we new here. These all are new here. You can see this is a glass bridge. Whoa! This is something new. This is nice, man. This looks awesome. See below. So fun to go. So keep moving. व्यूज फ्रॉम एव आर रियली ब्यूटिफुल एंड will definitely mesmerize you so make sure to spend some time up there netik netik so nice photography spot there i'll don't forget to take photos here see so nice <laughs> there is netik up so this spot also is very good for photography i have few pics I've been in my Insta. Here is the Insta link. You guys can go and check it out. We're almost done with the tour, and we'll be heading. Out. It's such a scenic place. Definitely take some time. Come here, breathe the fresh air without the mask. Definitely. And now on the way, we'll have some food because inside there is uh, there is no option to for you to have any food. So make sure whenever you come, take some time, relax, just chill. in this kind of 
benches which is you can find all over the park this side take some beautiful pictures spend some good time right nitrik definitely we need some refreshment so here is lime soda so on the way we have come to this resort so here we are in the young island resort so i think they have staying option also those are villas i'll go outside i'll show you and abhi to bhook lagi hai khana khana hai to idhar aaye so this is the outside you can see here i think many people can sit there that is so those are the villas outside you can see where you can come and stay don't know about the food we have to taste and then i can tell you guys so here are those cottages you can see if you want to come and stay then visit uh, rangantitu and then mysore and all i think it will be good for you if you are coming from very far i don't know about the rates that definitely you can check out it booking.com or in any of the google site but yeah this place is really nice you can definitely come stay enjoy the scenic views food here the food was really amazing it is really good so the property is definitely very huge you can see so many cottages are here So if you are coming for a day out, I think this is this can be a perfect. We can get away for you. So hope you guys have liked this video till now. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to give it a like, share, and subscribe. Our like subscription is free, guys. So do show some love by pressing that red button. Oh, see, this is the river. Oh my God, this is really nice. This man. is nice, man. We have to take nice photos here. They are already taking it. This is nice. Hello. So still two hours and thirty-two minutes to home. We had our lunch and I showed you the place. So nice it is. So now we are heading back. And if you want me to visit nearby places or if you have. Uh, like any place in mind that uh, you want me to cover, then do mention it in the below comment. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to give it a like, share, and subscribe. Bye. Not nice. <laughs> Not nice. Not nice. <laughs> we'll give you to the crocodiles. <laughs>